Good morning. One of the most common things that we get asked here at the Stratford Country Club is how to proceed after hitting a ball in the, in the hazard on hole number six. As you can see, I've just done that. Normally I wouldn't, but this is just for teaching purposes. So my options now, once I've hit the ball in the hazard, are as follows. I can re-tee the original shot and be hitting my third shot. I can find the ball in that jungle out there and play it as it lies. Or a couple other options, keeping the point where the ball last crossed the margin of the hazard and moving back, keeping the point where it last crossed in the flag line, I can go back as far as I want and play a shot. Or in the case of a lateral hazard as we have here at number six, I can drop it on the other side of the hazard, equidistant to where it last crossed and no closer to the hole. So follow me and we'll show you how this is done. One of the things to remember when proceeding under the lateral hazard rule and find, determining relief is that line of sight has no bearing on where your drop points can be. It is always the point where it last crossed the margin of the hazard. So as you can see on the shot I just hit, the point where it last crossed is directly in front of me. It never did leave the hazard while it was in the air. So the point where it last crossed is right in front. So I can come back on this line, keeping the flag in line, and I can drop my ball here and proceed with a one-shot penalty. So as you can see, the red stake here lined up on the other side is where it last crossed. One of the mistakes we see people make is that they will, they will take the relief on this side of the hazard, but they will then take their drop point in here. This would then be considered an illegal drop to which you would be subject to further penalties under the rules of golf. The proper way to do it, if this is the point where it last crossed the margin of the, ha the hazard, and knowing that there's a cart path here, I'm going to go to the closest point of relief, no closer to the hole, and take my relief there. So I have one of two options here. I can go on this side of the cart path here. Here I gain full relief. I could take my drop, making sure it remains behind the red stake, and proceed here under a penalty of one shot. The other point, and you would have to, together with your playing partners, measure to see where the closest point of, of relief is, but again, making sure that I keep, take full and complete relief and making sure that I stay behind where it last crossed, I could also take my relief here and proceed again under penalty of one shot.